we asked you a lot in the off season about what it'd be like learning a new offense when it was very early. Now that you've you know been in it for sixteen weeks, I'm curious. Like, what what are some of the biggest differences that you've had to make, or biggest changes you've had to make uh, this season as a quarterback? Um, you know, I think. Um, Obviously, the, the terminology and, and learning uh, how we're going to call things, how we're going to, uh, you know, ID things, and, and from that standpoint, and, and my job pre-snap and post-snap is is a little bit different, uh, you know, in this system. But I think that's something that uh, you know we've gotten comfortable with, and, and I've gotten comfortable with. I just, you know, I think um, seeing certain plays, seeing certain concepts, being able to. To rep them and, and see them in, in live game actions, learn from you know learn from from those reps and and uh, you know kind of um, you know take those uh, mental mental notes or mental pictures to to what you get in the game versus you know against certain certain plays and certain looks and being able to learn from that. So I think um, you know I certainly feel comfortable uh, where I am now and and I've enjoyed uh, you know learning it and and. Uh, Working through it. Thanks. Porter. Hey, Daniel. Um, hey, um, if um, um, the way things are trending, the Cowboys are scoring a lot of points the last month of the season, winning a lot of games. Um, if that trend continues, um, how equipped do you think you are and your offense is to match points with a team that's scoring, you know, upwards of 20s, 30s? You guys almost did that the first time against the Cowboys. How about now? Yeah, you know we're we're confident uh, as an offense, and and you know I think uh, we've got to take advantage of our opportunities uh, to score points, particularly when we get the ball in the red zone and, and move the ball down there. So um, you know we're we're, uh, we're certainly confident in our ability to to do that and, and score points. It is um, I mean the results have not shown that. What gives you that confidence? You know what gives you that you're getting close. Uh, well, we have done it, um, you know, at, at times, and and you know, you're right. We need to be more consistent with it. We need to finish those opportunities, but uh, we got the guys capable to do it, and and um, you know, we we've done it uh, in spurts this year, and and uh, you know, it's going to take our our best game on Sunday, and and that's certainly what we're preparing for. Thank you, Jordan. Hey, Daniel, how you doing? This is essentially a, a playoff game. Uh, you know, it's an elimination game for whoever loses this can't win the division. Uh, how do you intend on impro- approaching this game? And do you expect anything different? A lot of times with quarterbacks, these are the kind of games that people judge you on. Uh, yeah, you know, we're, we're not, uh, you know, focused on, um, you know, anything that happens after, you know, Sunday. You know, our, our job is to... Um, Prepare as well as we can and as hard as we can to to play our best game Sunday, and, and that's you know where our focus is is um, you know to be prepared as we as we possibly can and and play well. That's certainly my uh, you know individual focus as well. So um, that's a goal, and, and that's kind of our you know our mindset going in. Do you expect it to feel like a normal regular season game, or how much do you think it might you know the intensity might be ramped up to a different level than than you've seen so far? Uh, well, you know, it is a, a division game against a, an opponent we we know uh, very well, and and um, you know, so from that standpoint, yeah, it'll be uh, it will certainly be an intense uh, atmosphere, and and uh, you know, guys will be ready to go. We'll take two more. Tom Rock, Don Levy, Tom Rock. Daniel, do you do you feel ready to run now? You, you know, you haven't had a, uh, a designed carry since since you hurt your hamstring. You, you only have one uh, so far in the two games since you've been back. Do you feel like you're you're able to uh, make plays on, on the ground when when called upon? Um, yeah, you know, I think uh, you know I'll continue to to work with uh, the trainers and, and trust that that program. You know, I think. Um, you know, I've, I've played from the pocket, um, you know, the past couple of weeks, and and you know, I expect to, uh, you know, continue to do that until I'm until I'm uh, healthy. So, um, you know, we'll we'll see uh, what exactly, but um, you know, I expect the the game plan and and what I'm asked to do to be fairly similar to what it's been um, these past few weeks. How much of that? How much does that limit the entire offense? Do you think when when you're not able to 
to to make those plays. I mean, that was that was a big part of what you guys were doing for a long time. Uh, yeah, you know what? We got we got uh, a lot of ways to run the ball. We got uh, really good runners and and guys we can get into space and, and make plays. So, um, you know, I think um, you know we'll uh, we'll continue to do that. Get the ball to those guys, and, and you know, I'm not sure it it limits us a whole lot, but. Uh, we've got to be good with, uh, you know, what we can do. And then just just one more follow up on that. Uh, you know, how hard is it on you to sort of curb those instincts to take off with the ball and, and run, uh, if if that is in fact what you're what what you're being asked to do? Uh, you know, I think um, you know certainly something I have to be aware of with, uh, you know, my mobility and and you know what I can do and and something I'm you know cognizant of. Uh, playing the game, but um, you know, I think um, it's you know how I played these past couple of weeks, and you know, kind of gotten used to it. Daniel, I just want to go back full circle to what Doug and asked first. When did you uh, really feel comfortable in this offense, and was it harder to learn an offense, a new offense, in your second year than maybe you thought it would be when you first realized you were going to have to in you know last January? Um, you know, I certainly think I've, I've learned, uh, every week and I've, I've improved every week. I'm not sure that that's, um, you know, thinking, I'm not sure I think about my improvement and my progression and scope and, you know, with, uh, reference to our offense and, and understanding the system. I think of it more as, uh, you know, me as a, as a player and as a second year, uh, quarterback in this league learning and, and, uh, you know, trying to improve and, I've, you know, I've felt comfortable in this in this offense uh, this whole year, and, and um, you know, there's certainly been things I've learned and, and picked up on throughout the way. But um, as far as how I see my uh, progression and my improvement, I'm not sure I look at it, um, you know, based on being comfortable in the offense or, or anything uh, specific to that necessarily. Last, last one here, Jordan. Hey, Daniel, I just want to go back a second. You said you tend to play from the pocket until I'm healthy. Uh, do you not consider yourself near full strength? Is that kind of what you're referring to there? Uh, I feel good. I feel uh, I feel healthy, but, um, you know, I think you can tell that from the tape that, you know, I'm not, uh, you know, I can't do a lot of the same things I'm, I'm used to doing. So, uh, you know, I'll, I'll continue to work and, and work to improve, but... Um, you know, I'll, uh, for the time being, you know, I'll, I'll probably have to play, uh, adjust the, the way I've played, and, and uh, you know, I've been doing that the past few weeks. I mean, I'm not asking you to put a number on it, right? But but how close are you then to being at that point? Um, like, what do you like? How much are you limited to? Is kind of what I'm asking. Yeah, um, you know, I think. Um, Certainly haven't been uh, as involved in the run game, and uh, you know certain certain areas, uh, you know, getting out of the pocket and, and and running, scrambling, you know, things like that. But I feel good. I feel a lot better, and, and I'll continue to to work with the trainers to improve.